guys Ben here and welcome back to another video on Supergirl season 5 and today we're going to be talking about the trailer for episode 11 aka the return of Windshot. Also we're going to be talking about the new photos for that episode so if you do go on to enjoy the video please be sure to leave a like and a comment and subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any DC TV videos later this year. Okay so yeah. This video was supposed to go up a few days ago, and I simply didn't get around to actually making the video for the trailer, but, you know, they released the photos today, and I was like, why not? Let's just combine it, talk about the new photos, but also talk about the trailer for next week's episode. So, yeah, let's go ahead and get into the trailer first, then we'll talk about the photos and what's going on. There's a really cool thing to do with Alex that we need to talk about as well later in this video but anyway the first shot of the trailer is of a transport van for prisoners and then we go on to the next shot and it is hit by this thing you see this thing like in the middle of the road i don't know what it is but essentially it makes the van or bus topple over and that's how this version of wind shot returns so this is a version a double ganger of him as we saw and what was explained last episode, this version got arrested, he's on our earth, and he's around. So he is basically going to be a version of the Toy Master, it seems like. But anyway, so I'll get on to win in just a second, but you can see the bus is National City Men's Central Jail, so he was obviously around there. And then also you have this shot inside a place, I don't know exactly where it is, but... We have Lex talking to someone, and I'm guessing it might be Wynn. But then we get our first look at Wynn, he returns, and this is definitely after the bus crash because it looks like he's just, you know, crawled out or something like that. But then we got another look at Wynn, we get to see the sort of Toy Man persona in full play. He's in this sort of like turtleneck or jumper, and he's on the computer, he's hacking something. And yeah, just super excited to see that. We've got a bomb going off. You can see in the top corner, the top left corner, it says Toy Man. So he is being a Toy Man copycat, even though he's the son of him. So that kind of makes sense, right? However, obviously he's doing bad deeds. But this is a doppelganger we're talking about right now. So it's not actually our version of Win. So we'll have to wait and see as to if our version of Win pops up. We've got the shot. This dummy's head has been, you know, flung off, so maybe that's Wynn practicing, or it could be someone else. We have Kara, she looks down, seems like she's actually facing off against this evil or, you know, different version of Wynn in this shot right there. Then we got, again, Lex, he's sort of facing off. I don't know if this is Wynn or not, I could be wrong, but I think it's Wynn. And we go to the sort of toy place where we've been seeing in the past few trailers, we've got Kara and Alex together, and you've got these monkeys that are about to obviously explode, and you have Supergirl stopping the explosion in this final shot of the trailer. And so, yeah, the trailer is exciting, it shows some wind stuff, but doesn't really show exactly what's going on. I think the photos that have been released are actually a little bit more interesting than the trailer, because I think they give away some more stuff, and so yeah, let's go ahead and talk about this other stuff from the same very episode. We've got this photo right here, we've got Lex, Lena and Brainy, they're all working together, which is obviously piggybacking off of last episode and how Brainy is going to work with Lex because of the warning he got towards the end of last episode via one of the Brainiac 5's, Megan Raff's character, well her version of the character, warned him that he has to work with Lex otherwise things will go to shit basically but it's interesting that Lena's there as well and it seems like maybe they're all gonna work together then we got this photo of Lex and he's looking like he's in that same place he's just looking really cool sort of staring and yeah I just I'm really excited to see more Lex stuff because it was a big surprise that he was actually sticking around after Crisis because I didn't expect it but it's very smart that they did that to try and keep him around and you know he was in last episode he's in this episode and he's gonna be around for a while so then we move on we see sort of this different angle we see a crater so I like calling her a crater I just think it's a cool name we're gonna continue calling her a crater in some of these 
videos because yeah why not but anyway so we see her she's at this national city university event it seems like she gets this prize i don't know what the hell is going on in the background looks like a mascot or something maybe she's come back and she's collected this thing you know because she went there in the past or something like that and she's like a member of the alumni or something and so then we go to the audience it looks like this is actually at the same place people are running so some sort of attack or some sort of thing actually occurs at this event to actually have near there and to have brainy there to save whatever's going on or to you know help out basically so yeah i don't know it seems like it's probably to do with toy man as you can see in this next scene this is super exciting so it looks like to be a very similar place although the colors are very different however you do have the guy in the background with very similar hair to the past photo so i feel like it's at the same place but anyway we got win and he is running through here this is the copycat version of the toy man this is this version of win from another earth it seems like unless there is some big revelation that this is actually normal win but now we're all supposing that this is just like a doppelganger who you know maybe will come around and become good i'm not sure but anyway so everyone online on twitter has been pointing out that he's actually got a ring on his finger meaning that he's probably married so i wonder who he's married to will we get an explanation or is that just part of the design it's very much so probably done on purpose so i'm very very curious to see if there is some sort of explanation so we go back to that event i really like this photo you get to see the reaction of kara to some sort of attack and you see a cross in the back and she obviously is in shock so it seems like yeah the toy man has arrived here he's done some shit and this is their reaction and it's a pretty precious photo so yeah let's move on we've got another photo of the two of them and you see the audience members just behind as well from a different angle from the side Kara has got her arm out she's like you know don't move don't step forward I've got this basically and moving on to the next photo same place Kara looking really cool just you know a nice photo and she's basically confronting the toy man in this photo and then we go on to some super exciting stuff and you know why it's so exciting look at this we have win he's got a mask on and it seems like he's actually teaming up with our super friends so i don't know what's going on something happens to twist him but this version of win seems like it turns good but he's like the toy man at first as far as we know however he's with nia brainy and alex he's sandwiched between them all and it just looks super super cool look at this tell me you're not hyped after seeing some of these photos we get another photo with just supergirl again well cool love the photo same with this one of alex alex is in the audience it's very blue so this goes along with the one with win running and this is one of the best photos this is of alex and win reunited and if you remember how they actually left each other for the last time when they said goodbye alex was crying sort of leaning on win and i just thought wow this is really such a nice way to bring them back together i don't know it just gets me so nostalgic and so excited for this episode to see the return of win one of my favorite characters we haven't seen him in two seasons basically and you know i really really miss him and i just can't wait to see him return and this photo especially has got me like wow i can't wait and so then we move on to this next photo we've got kara and alex in this new sort of layer of operation so i'm not sure what's happening here maybe this is actually win's base but anyway so you can see in the background there is a wanted poster for Win, and so it seems like there is actually more to him than just being a person who escaped from a prison truck and you know maybe was the toy man for a bit i think there is another thing because they are casually talking kara's in her normal sort of everyday wear she's got a blazer on she's got a shirt on no supergirl stuff no confrontational stance or anything got alex in normal clothing no deo clothing and this version of win is just sort of relaxed he's leaning against the table and everything like that so yeah i'm not sure as to if this is exactly our version of win however he's acting like he's our version of win 
because look at this last photo right here got Alex Cara and Jean it just gets me so so excited to see the space family back together with Wynn returning and yeah it's just so cool look at him he's got his hands on his hips he's smiling looking at Jean they seem like they're having a great time and I mean just come on this is perfect and I can't wait so the final thing that I want to talk about in this video is this right here and at first I thought this was like a digital sort of manipulation I thought that someone just edited this it turns out this is actually Kyla. Kyla was wearing this. It's a new Supergirl suit, unless I'm being absolutely dumb. I'm pretty damn sure she actually dressed up like this, and I think this is in the 100th episode. And I'm pretty sure it's real. However, it could be fake. I don't know why I've got a feeling it could be fake. However, for now we're going to say it's real until proven not that Alex is going to be wearing a version of the Supergirl suit that looks like this. I mean, if it is real, it looks so freaking cool. And she's rocking Kara's hairstyle with the bangs and everything like that. But she's got black hair and she looks so cool. I just really hope this is real. And I think this could be in the 100th episode. But what do you guys think is going on with this photo? I was so shocked when I saw it. I was like, is this fake? But if it's real, this is so great. So that's about it for this video, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed it. And I'll catch you guys later for another video. Goodbye. I see red.